<laughs> Put some breakfast on my finger. Good morning, everybody. Today is Sunday, February 7th, 2021, week number 114. 114. You took my job. Cut. Cut. Today Cut over. is week number... 114. There we go. <laughs> Quick way in. Sorry. Uh, yesterday was extremely busy. I had to be to work early and I'm off and on my way this morning as well. Um, we had a little snow, so I have to leave a little early. So we got to do a little quick. Yeah, you got to get you on the road, get you safe. Exactly. Well, last week I was 334 and uh, I will explain in just a little bit, but uh, today I was 337. I'm not even going to blame it on the bathroom because it wasn't the bathroom. <laughs> I will explain. And Stacy, where are you? Last week I weighed in at 140, and today I weighed in at 139. Oh, so you're doing good. Down a pound. Still got to get it go, but I'm. I go up, you go down. Yeah. That's what she said. <laughs> I knew that was. <laughs> She's just laughing, so I just having fun with it. We have had. <clears throat> The last two weeks, some pretty bad news lately. Uh, Stacey lost her uncle last mm -hmm. week. And then um, during this week that we just went through, um, I had a good friend who had to take his dad off life support uh, due to all the viral stuff that's out there in the world. It was that. And um, they had to make a decision to take him off life support. So uh, I had gone out and visited him and um, rough, mm -hmm. rough week. And then and our then, uh, uh, daughter's roommate um, took their own life. Took his life. So um, that was another <clears throat> kind of a gut punch that week of, of this last week, as well as um, my very very first elementary school friend um, that jumped on Facebook, which I don't normally even do nowadays, um, and found out that he has uh, cancer, and uh, he's been in and out of chemo, in and out of the hospital. So um, depending on how things go and where where this treatment ends up, <clears throat> clock is going crazy. Uh, I might try and come out and see them and um, they're out in Minnesota. <clears throat> so uh, yeah, needless to say, there's not been much sleep. There's probably been some stressful, I wouldn't say blowing keto, but you know, just Maybe a little mean. overeating, yeah. probably something I'll admit to always having a problem with, stress and and uh, things like that. Yeah. And then to top it off, I did something to my leg. Um, uh, I pulled I pulled a muscle or something in my calf to where for three days I could barely even just get up and stand and walk. Yeah. And uh, Stacey's been real good about trying to help me, you know, like rubbing it out and... Uh, Putting biofreeze on it and tried ice and oh, it's just. This is a calf muscle about four years ago that he tore seventy five percent. Mm hmm. And I thought for sure I'd have to have surgery. Yeah. And uh, it swelled up to the size of my thigh, much less my calf. So mm -hmm. you know, no excuses, guys. Every Saturday we're going to come in and give you our numbers, and unfortunately, you know, and I'm going to tell you the truth, and unfortunately, mine were way up uh, three pounds this week, um, and I don't even really have. I wouldn't say excuses, but it's just this is this is the week we had, and this is where I landed. Um, yeah. I can tell you last night, we have those 32-ounce glasses that I always use. I love these things. It's like the Pizza Hut glass, but it's clear. Except for it's clear. But anyway, if, you, if you're if you old enough to remember the red Pizza Hut glasses. <laughs> but anyway, um, I drank two of these last night before bed, and these are 32 ounces. So maybe that's a little bit of extra fluid in me at the moment. Yeah. But I'm not going to, you know, make up excuses. It's, it, it's just not the greatest week. No. So we're going to get Stacy off to work safely today mm -hmm. and get on the road and go slow and yeah. be safe because it's slippery and slickery out there. Mm -hmm. And uh, I hope that you sincerely hope that you had a better week than we did. Um, hoping to come back next week and feeling better and doing better and have a whole lot less crazy news yeah yeah um trying to just stay positive in this negative world at the moment i yeah. i don't know i don't know what else to say except for i hope everybody's doing well and uh i'm, I'm praying for better days mm -hmm. so this is our week keto update of 114 
114? Um, <clears throat> I'd say keto was probably on the lowest part of my list. I even feel a little strange making a keto update this week because there's been so many other things going on. It's about the journey, not necessarily yeah. just about the keto. So. True. And everybody has their good weeks and their bad weeks. Yeah. My roller coaster is on its downward journey. But, yeah. you know, the roller coasters, they always go back up. Too. Yeah. So to the thrilling part. So let's uh, let's hope for that. Yeah. All right, guys. Thanks again for checking in with us, and we will let you enjoy your weekend. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.